Understanding personal space in English-speaking cultures. Hello, English learners. Today, we're diving into an essential part of communication that goes beyond words. Body language. Specifically, we'll discuss personal space and distance in English-speaking cultures. Understanding this can make your interactions smoother and more comfortable. Personal space refers to the invisible bubble around us that we feel comfortable having people within. When someone enters this space uninvited, it can feel intrusive or uncomfortable. In English-speaking cultures, the concept of personal space is vital, and the size of this bubble can vary based on the relationship, situation, and cultural background. Dr. Edward T. Hall an anthropologist, identified four primary zones of personal space. 1. Intimate distance, 0 to 18 inches. This zone is for close relationships, family, close friends, and sometimes romantic partners. 2. Personal distance, 18 inches to 4 feet, suitable for conversations among good friends or close colleagues. 3. Social distance, 4 to 12 feet, used for acquaintances or in more formal settings, like a workplace. 4. Public distance, more than 12 feet, appropriate for public speaking or when individuals don't know each other. It's essential to gauge the comfort level and adjust your distance accordingly. While these zones offer a general guideline, context is crucial. For example, Crowded places like subways or concerts might force people to be closer than they prefer. Additionally, individual comfort levels can vary due to personal experiences or cultural backgrounds. It's vital to be aware of nonverbal cues that someone might be feeling their personal space is being invaded. Backing away slightly, crossing arms or creating a barrier, avoiding eye contact looking around for an escape route. If you notice these, it's a good idea to give the person a bit more space. When in English-speaking countries, remember, observe, look at how locals interact. Ask if unsure. It's okay to check in with someone if you're uncertain about the distance. Respect boundaries. Always be mindful of others' comfort. That wraps up our discussion on personal space in English-speaking cultures. Remember, communication is more than just words. By understanding and respecting personal space, you'll navigate social situations more gracefully. Happy learning, and see you in the next video.